So that is recording up there. Uh, addition is recording. I'm just going to cancel this one and start over. Hello, hello. Okay, we're good. Hello. Okay, man. I think we're ready to rock. You ready? All right. Can I make this big? Can't make you. you can't no, make you can't make us big. Oh, well. That's, that's but cool. at least we're still on the camera. That's all that really matters. We're on the camera. We're on the right camera. And Yeah. Oops. Problems. <laughs> we having problems. All right. All right, all right, all right. There. there we go. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why do you do this to me? There we go. Okay. Oh, oh wow. All right. Snap features, eh? Yeah. I downloaded a tool. I wish they would just have Actually, snap features built into. Uh, they have, but it's really shitty. Remember, you have to like hold this. On some, you hold the green on some of them. And oh like, yeah, I remember. Right? Yeah, there you but go. Yeah. S- s- oh fuck off! And then you have, see. Look, this is the thing. If you have like a torrented thing, it won't allow it. See, right? It's saying yeah. like this. Yeah. Fuck it. Fuck you, Apple. <laughs> fuck them, okay. faggots. We're no, good. Just kidding. We're good, man. <laughs> Don't record that. <laughs> Video is working. Audio is work- we're working. We're ready. Rock working. Rocking. We're rocking. All right. Which one do you want to start off? Sometimes with? the words don't come out right. Yeah. Oh, don't worry. I know. Uh, what are we starting with? Oh, we can start with yours. What was mine? <laughs> YouTube ads. Did you like my notepad? My book? Is that where you put your topics? I just write everything in these, <laughs> man. I just right. I just got this one from Costco's. All right. All right. Really? <laughs> Your pen doesn't Fuck! work. <laughs> That's why you have a secondary pen That's sitting a right pen- there. It's a pencil. Whatever. <laughs> Your, that entire badassery that you just did got undone by your, your fucking pen not working. I know. I had, so, I had, I had something going and then you it just did. didn't work for me. What are we doing first? Uh, we're doing your topic with ads. Ads. On podcasts and YouTube. On podcasts. Uh, number two will be... I'm just going to put and other media. Yeah. Uh, number two will be... We should end uh, with lying. Li- no, let's yeah. do lying. You want to do lying next? Yeah, let's do okay, lying. Okay, let's do lying next. Uh, what is it? Should you be... When, when, um, is, when is lying acceptable? When is, oh yeah, when is lying acceptable? Lots. <laughs> or what kind of lie they're acceptable? You know, like... Yeah, 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 well, yeah. Well, lying is the... Lying thing. Yeah. Okay, three is... Uh, uh, let's do pet peeves. Okay, I have lots of pet peeves. Oh, fuck. And then the fourth one will be our uh, <laughs> our legacy. <laughs> oh, fucking <laughs> what, legacy. What kind of legacy do you want to... Le- I'm just going to legacy. <laughs> I have to think about it. Oh, that's funny. Mic drop. <laughs> okay, ready? All right. Oh, fuck, I'm so fat. Okay, go. <laughs> All right. The sad thing with this camera angle is you just see, like, all my gray hair. <laughs> you see <laughs> Oh, because of this side? Yeah, because of the side. Because it's, like, short. <laughs> Dude, look what I did. It grew in, but I went to fix my hair the other day, and I, like, went to cut and went bald. <laughs> so, like, that's twice you, I've done Do you that. go to an actual person, or do yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, but I was trying to fix it myself to save money. No, I can't. Don't do that. I, I get my hair and my beard trimmed. See? At the same time. I wish I got my beard trimmed, but I don't have one. Never. I want to see you with a I beard. I have come to the realization, <laughs> man. So it's funny. not... It, Dude, you want to hear something funny? I went to Colton's a couple weeks ago to watch the Conor McGregor UFC fight. Yeah. So there's me, Colton, his friend Brendan, his friend Brett, and we're all sitting there, and some guy came out with this nasty beard, like just amazing. And we're just like, fuck, that guy's got a badass beard. And we all looked at each other, and we're like, none of us can grow a full beard. <laughs> like, none of us. Like, you know, like, sh- five o'clock shadow is the best we can do. I, like, I don't think your face thing. even could handle a beard. I think, you know, this is <laughs> this is my honest-to-God theory why I can't grow a beard. Because I my face contains too much fat that the hair can't come through. <laughs> come on, let me have it. Oh, God. I'm not going to let you have that because oh. I'm a bigger guy than you and I still have a fucking big beard. <laughs> I went to school with the guys in grade 8 who had a beard like you. <laughs> eight year? No, what is that? Uh, I graduated grade 12, so I had four more years. So 12 years later, I still can't grow a beard like they can. Fuck me, man. <laughs> I just hate shaving, my but da- my dad can only grow a mustache. So. Let's let's actually get into a topic first. Let's, let's actually intro the show. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I like the starting though. I like the starting to be good. Welcome everyone to the game of Greggy Show. <laughs> no, well that's copyright infringement now. <laughs> we don't have. I don't any- know if they actually have a copyright on. I that. don't have any money. They can't sue me. They could sue you. <laughs> They'll they just could. go against your girlfriend. <laughs> I'm, but I'm a best friend. That's true. They probably wouldn't. Yes. Okay. 
Welcome, everybody, to another episode of the Max and Capacity Show. Capacity. Um, capa- all right. Beyond. <laughs> Is that where we're going to start now? Capacity. That's right. Look. That's, that's good. That's actually really good. Or we're just waiting for everybody else to yell capacity at the same time. I just want to walk down the street and somebody's like, capacity! <laughs> that would be sweet. That would be actually pretty cool. I think that would be... I think that would make my life. That's when you made it. Life. You made it. That would make my life. If someone came up to you and was like, hey, man, capacity! <laughs> <laughs> then I'm going to die if somebody just... Oh, hey, man, fuck that capacity! <laughs> Um, this is a show that we uh, talk about random topics. Um, we usually have four topics. We break them down uh, topic by topic, uh, day, by day by day, day. Uh, right. Monday through Friday, or Monday through Thursday. And then we post the entire thing on Friday. Video and audio. Everything. So if you don't want to listen to the break, broken up stuff, you don't want to wait, well, you probably still have to wait till Friday. You have to wait. But if you want to watch an hour or more, then just wait till Friday. You know what? Because a lot of people do that. We could have the audio that. release on Monday if we had like a Patreon. Yeah, we could. Nice. I've, I've not, thought about it. That'd be cool. Not yeah. yet. Eventually. Not yet. Not yet. Yeah. That's 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 let's not get ahead of the let's not get ahead of us <laughs> ourselves here. English. It's very tough. Uh, this is a special episode. English. Uh, because I'm in town. <laughs> Harv's here. I'm in town, You're and back. we're actually recording this together. This only happens once every couple months. Yeah, couple months? That, Actually, makes, you know that makes me feel like I come here way too often. I think every the last two times you came, we were going to do this, and we never did. We, we just, didn't. The last, last, time, last time we were supposed to do it, but we didn't have enough time, and we drank too much. Yeah, and we drank too much. We're still drinking tonight. I'm a little buzzed. Yeah? I haven't... This I'm is okay. My, I'm, this, at, I'm at the... This is my fourth alcoholic beverage in 2016. That's impressive. My third was the first I've one I had. I've had four in the last two days. I know. <laughs> I went to dinner with a friend the other... Well, uh, anyways, with people, and uh, I told him that, and he like just about fell to the floor. Yeah, that's. <sighs> what 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 is your? Why <laughs> my reasoning? <laughs> uh, I don't know, man. It, it I've been getting feeling really shitty. Like I get all red and stuff. I'm feeling good tonight, and it just because makes I'm me here. F- yeah, and uh, <laughs> I don't know. I just if I go to the gym the next day, it's hard to have a good workout. It is because you feel like crap. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I but know. I also like okay. So I like drinking on special occasions. Last time that I drank heavily was last weekend. Oh, you had some black tie thing. Yeah, I had the black guys. tie thing that I went to. Uh, you can follow me at Anna of Parmar. She's <laughs> um, plugged right now. Yeah, and um, and I had high quality alcohol, high quality stuff. The, the whole time. The whole time. So we had good like wild turkey, pretty good stuff. Bourbon, whiskey. Really? Yeah. Wild turkey whiskey? Yeah. Oh. Very good. And then we went to the VIP section of the place because... Because you're VIP? Really I'm at Hart Palmer. Everybody knows me. <laughs> <laughs> <And laughs> I'm at Hart At Hart Palmer. And uh, <laughs> we, went, uh, we went to the VIP and they had Belvedere and Grey Goose Ooh. as their vodkas. Oh, I don't like Grey Goose. Belvedere is good. I had that like, with pineapple juice. Oh, I drank oh. that all night with champagne. You Dude. mixed a lot. How hungover are you the next day? I wasn't. I was. The thing is, I wasn't hungover. I was just drained. That was the only thing. Yeah. There's okay. a difference between being hungover and drained. What time did you get home though? Got home around four. Yeah, that that'd be the reason why you were drained. Uh, you went with Derek and Sunny. Yes. Were they hungover the next day? Derek was not. He was also drained. Was Sunny was fucked up? I don't know if Sunny was fucked up because oh. he went home. Oh. <laughs> Afterwards, I like Sunny. Sunny's good. Yeah, man. he's like he's good people. I like Sunny. He's good funny. people. I like him on the podcast. But yeah, so that's that's that's. I think it all kind of depends on what kind of alcohol you have. That's true. Yeah, you know what? You've ever had MGD Miller Genuine Draft? You have to spell that one. Yeah, out? I did. I had to. <laughs> I wanted to make sure I had it right. Yes, I had a couple beers of those in the summer last year, and it fucked me up, man. Because yeah, that's low quality oh, shit. It's, it's low quality, that's man. Low quality I felt stuff. like garbage the next day. Yeah. No, you gotta have the good shit like the. But like, if you look at like any like kind white of white owl, yeah. White but like any good, kind man. of beer is gonna fuck you up, though. That's just how it is. Beer is like a starter. Yeah. And then you get into the good stuff. Yeah. I like alcohol, but I don't like the feeling. Like I always feel shitty the next day. Like not hungover, just the entire day I don't feel right. From like the morning fucking like shit to the to the. <laughs> That's when, so true. <laughs> to when you go to bed, it is true. It's man. so true. I don't care. I always gotta take a shit in the morning, and it's the nastiest. It's not shit. pleasant. It's the nastiest <laughs> shit. It's just not a pleasant experience. It's just. <laughs> Dude, there's some days. Look, series like what? Explain. Explain, explain the shit yourself. that you have. 
<laughs> this is for Apple marketing. Yeah. They want to know what kind of shits we have in the morning after after drinking. Oh, really, computer? Don't do that. It's called a screensaver. Fuck you, screensaver. I swore. God damn it. I broke it already. Ten hey, minutes you, in. You swore last time, too. I know. Only twice. Wow, you counted. Yeah, you I did. You have a swear counter? You have a swear, a swear jar? jar? Like Homer. <laughs> Every time $100 goes in, and once I get to the money, I could buy a new mic. So I'm going to swear a lot. It's Carrie's money, too. That sounds very counterproductive, but all right. <laughs> uh, I forget what I was saying. You're talking about alcohol. Oh, yeah. You like, Yeah, you sound, you now sound, but you feel shitty the next day. Yes, I feel very, like, and not hungover. I don't think I've actually literally ever been hungover throwing up the next day. That, no, that never, that's only happened to me once. I, once. I, uh. That was in high school, though, because that kind of shit's just, yeah. that kind of shit just happens. I went to a shopper's party in high school when I was, like, 18, maybe 17. And I got just destroyed. It's the only time I've ever been, like, really bad dra- blackout drunk. Not, like, where you forget a few parts. Like, I don't remember, like, seven hours. That's fucked up. I woke up the next day in that bedroom next to us with my flip phone on the ground. covered. <laughs> I in, fucking hate that. Covered in my vomit. <laughs> oh, okay. That, it I did not that. work anymore. Okay, it was an expensive night. So my phone didn't work. <laughs> I waddled to the bathroom. Yeah, I waddled like a duck, a hungover duck. Went to the bathroom, threw up, came out. And this is when my brother lived here and my mom and my dad were still uh, together. And my brother just comes up to me. He's like, you're a dick. And I was like, I was like, why? I had to work. And I phoned in and they're like, yeah, we knew you weren't coming in today. It was a Sunday morning. And my brother's like, you're a dick. I'm like, why? He's like, yeah, so I picked you up. You're drunk ass because people I've never heard of phoned me and like you need to pick your brother up from some place i've never been to <laughs> so he's like i come get you he put me in the back seat i guess i rolled the windows down and when i got home it was winter oh you fucking well because i was throwing up out of the window when he was driving uh... me home okay but that's not the bad part apparently i left the windows down oh shit and it had snowed so oh, his car shit. was full of snow and he couldn't roll his windows up for like two days because of frozen too and yeah so anyways, i i walk outside it literally from where i got out of his car to the front house was just streaks of my vomit in the snow oh. like but the thing is i didn't even feel that shitty the next day it's because day. you vomited that's the biggest I threw thing every yeah that's the biggest i thing, was yeah. just like like i need to the be- shit isn't inside you yeah but i was like i need to just be physically laying all day yeah but i didn't feel like like, oh, like, Carrie's had some bad hangovers. I wasn't like that. because you said I got it all out. Yeah. But that's the worst thing I've ever been. But, like, I still wake up and you feel, like, not 100%, right? Yeah. No, no, that makes sense. Yeah. So, anyways, I've been trying to avoid that. But not tonight. They go down so smooth. Though, especially do. when you're having a good time and you have they people. Do. And you're not paying $9 per drink. Or if you're in Vancouver, you're paying 15 bucks a drink. <sighs> yeah. Depending on where you are. The Irish Heather. <laughs> Heather. And they, I, my English is bad, but fuck, man. Come on. <laughs> Heather. Heather. All right, let's get to our first topic because we haven't even got to a topic yet. <laughs> Topics. Topic number one. Topic number one. My topic today is uh, what do you think of ads on the internet? So things on podcasts and just other medias. Podcasts is specifically why I thought of this. I was listening to a podcast through this. If company. anybody wants to give us ads, just let us know. Like, we'll. Yeah, we'll put them in. <laughs> we're not. We're not below that. We're not below. We're just gonna discuss it. We'll just discuss and it. rip it apart. But we're not gonna <laughs> and say how it's a bad business idea. But. Yeah. Uh, so, anyways, there's this company is called Podcast One, and they host a shit ton of podcasts, like a bunch of really popular ones. But you have to be a somebody to be part of their like network. So, like, I sort of the first one I listened to was like Stone Cold Steve Austin's podcast, where literally every five minutes, all he talks about is. Uh, have a swig for the – or have a drink for the working man. That's what he says, like, every five minutes. It's like, okay, Stone what, Cold. Stone Cold says that? Yeah. It's like, I'm done with you, thanks. Anyways, but every single person on there, the first, like, eight minutes is ads. I fucking hate that. And it's like, I'm not ever going to listen to it. I don't care. They're all for, like uh, – what's the U- U.S. Postal one where you get uh, mail, mail, mail stamps or something? Oh, every US podcast. Postals. No, 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 no. Yeah, there's this, this company uh, – Oh, crap. I can't remember. But they literally, they send you a scale and like $100 worth of free like uh, um, postage. And it's like, instead of going to the post office, you weigh everything at home and like label it and put it outside. It's like stamps.com. Stamps.com. Wow. Every single person has stamps.com and no one uses stamps.com. <laughs> There's no point to use stamps.com. What does it even do? Th- it's what I said. They send you a scale and like $100 worth of free stamps. And you literally, if you have a business, you can, like, send stuff. Every time I go to the store, they always ask me if I collect stamps. 
Who collects stamps? 2016. <laughs> How is stamps a real thing, man? Well, well, you have to send your letter somewhere. Who sends letters? <laughs> I haven't sent a letter in five years. I literally haven't sent. You know what I used to send? Magic the Gathering cards in the mail. Nice. That's it. Nice. I, I literally don't think I've ever sent them. I don't think I've ever sent a legit letter to someone. That's email, man. Email is the way to go. Uh, I, I I completely agree with the whole thing where you when you put like five minutes of ads, it just takes you out of the experience. Like, okay, I want to click on this podcast. I want to listen to this podcast, and I want to know what they're talking about. I have to go through six seven minutes. And it's not like a big deal. You just skip, but it's annoying. Sometimes you can't skip. Sometimes oh, they I've have a thing where you yet. can't skip. You have to listen to the ads. Oh, I would, I would literally just not listen. To it's that. like one of those things where the first bar is seven minutes, and it's the seven minute ads, oh. and you can't skip I through it. I haven't experienced that yet. That's that's even worse. So, also another thing we're going to talk about is the YouTube ads, which is fine, right? I think YouTube ads are fine because they're thirty accepti- seconds. Yeah, they're thirty seconds. I don't give a it's fuck. More acceptable. Yes, that's fine with me because I'll wait thirty seconds. Sometimes I don't have to wait thirty seconds, even if it's a thirty second ad. You can just skip out for five seconds. That's yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. And you're actually contributing to that person. Yeah, to which, that person. Yeah, I get it. Content creators. My ad block doesn't work on YouTube anymore. I don't use it just for that thing because I don't care about the ads. Ads aren't like oh, a big it thing. It bugs for me. me. It really <laughs> it bugs me. If it if it is there and I can't deal with them, like whatever, it's not a big deal. But I'll wait five seconds. But see, that's the thing. Like when when people use YouTube as a, as their media player or they use like yeah. that kind of thing. It's then their, it can be annoying yeah. because you want to listen to a song and then an ad comes on for 30 seconds or five seconds or whatever it is. See, there's other podcasts there, like Joe Rogan's podcast. His he video has ads too. Only on his audio. On his YouTube uploads, it's just the show. There's no ads. So once he finishes the conversation with the person, uh, I see what he means. he'll record know. the ads and put them at the front of his audio. So if you listen to his audio podcast, you have to skip through his ads. So but, he's trying to get revenue out of his audio and his video, but but video is just by views. Video for, by for audio. YouTube ads. Yeah, that's what I mean. But not like a double whammy. Yeah. And I mean, uh, that's fine because like you said, the YouTube ads like 30 seconds. You can skip after five seconds or whatever. Yeah. Um, but the seven, eight, ten minutes, Chris Jericho, the professional wrestler who has a podcast, he has 10 to 15 minutes sometimes of ads. Are you kidding me? Does he want... get annoyed with it? <laughs> no. You think? You know, the, the thing that pisses me off the most is they all say, I'm not advertising anything I don't use. You're telling me that you're a multi-millionaire, rock band, professional wrestler, actor, and you're telling me you use stamps.com for what? Don't lie to me. <laughs> <laughs> don't lie to me. You're not. You don't use it. God. He probably gets that shit and just burns it. <laughs> oh, you know what? The, the one ad in podcasts and stuff that I'm fine with is when people say use my Amazon affiliate link. So you go to like Amazon.com. So it's like the wish list kind of thing. No, right? no, 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 no. You go to like say Phil DeFranco. You go to yeah. Amazon.com slash Phil, and whenever you buy something, he gets a kickback. Okay. So if you're physically going, I to Amazon, see. Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah, I know That's what you're talking about. That's the yeah. only one. I can actually see people in the real world using, saying, like, hey, I really like Philip DeFranco. He's my favorite show. All I have to do is go to Amazon.com slash Phil and do my regular browsing, and he gets 5% of what I buy, which is fine because I'm supporting someone I like. But I'm not going to go to Stamps.com. I'm not going to go to freaking CavemanCoffee.com or whatever. All these things <laughs> that these people don't use. I know Man, they don't use. I don't drink coffee. You, have you listened to Serial, the podcast with the... I've listened to some of it. Okay. For s- this company got on with them and they got huge. It's called MailChimp. It's oh, like yeah. S- yeah. That's, I, I, no I, one I, uses MailChimp either. It's only around because of cereal. It no, makes no, me mad. No, no. Is I, I have to disagree real? with you. Yeah. MailChimp is a big company. Okay. Well, huge company. I've never heard of them until that. They, they, I, they're the people that give you automated emails. Like if company gives you automated emails oh, and stuff. Oh, like spam? Yeah. MailChimp is like that. <laughs> Great. And like it's, it's not even about spam. It's like if you sign up to something, say yeah. I sign up to your website. And I don't have the resources of creating a back end to send emails to every and single person. Do MailChimp does okay, it for you. Okay. So they send newsletters. They send that I take thing. that back, I, I used I'll MailChimp for my first job. Oh, did you? That I did, And it was yeah. good? It was fine. Like they're, it's, They do what they're Yeah, they're doing what they're doing. Okay. Yeah. I take that back. Because you can customize your entire newsletter to what you want it what to be want. and stuff. Okay. Yeah. MailChimp is a good, it's a good thing for small businesses that want to send emails. Okay. Yeah. Fuck you stamps.com though. That yes. You see that I don't I don't see. Like first of all, I'm I'm actually like okay, I I'm going a little off topic but this is just a thought. I find it really hard 
that like Canada Post and the United States Postal Service is still around. Don't really? <laughs> but you have to send you have, but you have to send something though. Pure, you go th- pure later. Yeah, but it's the same. DNS. It's the same shit though. Is like it it's, DNS. Yeah, it's DNS. Yeah. No. That's a DHL. DHL. There you go. That's what it is. Uh, no, but you still have to send shit though. Like if you look at like, I don't get any bills in the mail. I get them all automated. No, that's fine. Bill. But what if somebody wants to send you something through Amazon? You have to go through the U.S. Postal Service or yeah. uh, Canadian Postal. I just need like, one company that delivers my boxes from Amazon. That's let it. it. Let it be a government thing then. I guess. Don't, don't go I through guess. UPS. I don't guess. go through this kind of thing. Like just. Put, I guess. But I've heard horror stories about the whole postal service and the American Postal Service is pretty bad too. Well, dude, like I spend a lot of time on Reddit, and at least once a week I see a, a home like surveillance of like the UPS guy throwing yeah. their package from the end of the driveway <laughs> <laughs> to their front door. It's and like, it's, fuck it. <laughs> yeah, and the guy's like, yeah, that was my iPad. And it's like, that's awesome, man. The guy doesn't give a shit. That's awesome. And he just, he just drive by, throw your iPad. What if that was door. your iPad? I'd, I'd be sad. Then. <laughs> But I don't fuck have that guy. I don't have a home camera to catch him doing it. I would just be sad when I. Open There's some it up. fucked up shit that people get on camera. <laughs> but <laughs> you know what, man? You know what's really screwed up? Russian uh, drive driving cams. What the hell? You, oh yeah. What, what are those things called? Cameras, driving cameras. Uh, window, window dash cams. Dash cams. That, yeah, they catch some yeah. crazy. Those people need some road rules, man. Well, if you've ever been to India, they need road rules too. But I they went don't to have Egypt, any. man. Yeah, they they have no they road rules no too. They had no stop signs. They had no street lights, and no one had side mirrors because in like a two lane road like Vancouver and Prince George, you, you, you they have had four vehicles. Yeah, I I physically wouldn't have been able to open the door to save my life. Yeah, that's how it goes. Because like, and they get <laughs> less accidents than we do. I know. Yeah, exactly, dude. They had a thousand cars, and, and they actually use their horn. They had a thousand car. I swear. Okay, uh, they had one hundred. This is real. They had a hundred cars in a, a huge intersection, no lights. Everyone was going. They honked, and there was no accident. They drove better than we do here. Yeah, I couldn't believe it. Like I, I gave the cab driver props. I'm like, dude, you drive drove better than my <laughs> really quiet town at like five p.m. with like half the traffic. I just got into town today, and I was just looking. I was like, man, this town is dead. <laughs> It is, but anyways, it's we're getting so tiny. we're getting off the point. We are way off. <laughs> we're off the point. We're off. Where we're talking about ads, ads, and in podcasts, in podcast, and they're stupid. They should never do them. They, they should do them. Okay, so doing them is fine, but doing a five minute ad for something like I would have you ever, one sponsor. You ever listen to the Patch? No, I've never even heard of the Patch. It's Rooster Teeth. It's their podcast. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, they they yeah. have they have their own podcast. And yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure it's I, on I've iTunes. I've only ever watched their YouTube version. Yeah, so have I, right? Oh, okay. But I'm pretty sure they probably still have it on the iTunes oh, version yeah, probably, too, right? Probably. Like all that kind of thing. But like they have a good like they they put their sponsors at the start saying these are their two sponsors and then in the middle of the show they mm. do a nice 2 minute spiel about it. They do like a bumper. Yeah, it's like a bumper about yeah. it. That's that's all it is. See, but going 5 10 minutes on ads on like more than like 5 ads. Like seven sponsors. It's like you don't use these for sure. For sure. They're just giving them money, though. To... And yeah. If you... Okay, listen. If someone emailed us right now and said, hey, uh, we are Squarespace. This is, for example, because Build that's it a, beautiful. Exactly. That's a company that I would actually use, okay? Let's just Build let's it. just say that. Beautiful. So they say, hey, we want you guys to do a two-minute ad once in the show and we'll give you $1,000 a month. I would say yes and only have one sponsor, and I would make sure that the website we use for our whatever would be through them to yeah. prove that, A, we're using this because... We believe in it, and, and, and that's the only reason we're having an ad. For and it. also, it tells you that I've used this. This is how it is, and exactly, it's easy. Exactly. We, we've been through it. We've used this thing. Before. And if something better came along, and we switched, I wouldn't do ads for them anymore. I would say, sorry, I found a better company. Yeah. And yeah. that's the only way I think that ads in like things like podcasts are actually viable. Because YouTube, you don't get to pick the ad. They just no, they, place an ad. Whoever, uh, whoever's paying for the ad. Exactly. Uh, so, like, for podcasts, though, like, man, not a lot of them do it anymore. I think a lot of people are moving away from them. But, like, that one company, Podcast One, man, every podcast I listen to that's from them is, like, seven minutes of at the beginning. Yeah, and it's, it. like, skip, 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 skip. And then, you know what? I end up, like, a minute and then I have to go back. It's just annoying. Yeah, it I, almost turns me off of listening to them. That's that's a, that's a lot of people think about YouTube ads, too, right? Because YouTube ads, yeah. uh, they don't, like, if if you see an ad, even if, okay, so this is this is the problem with society that we have now. Patience. It's, it, we have no patience. Yeah, nothing. We, we have no attention span Ten anymore. Ten seconds. Yeah. So if you see an yeah. ad for 15 seconds, fuck it. Yeah. Just go through the 15 seconds 
and just listen to it. Or don't mute it if you yeah. want to do that. Just fucking mute just it. Take your, I you just don't take, need to listen to it. I just take my phone out for like 15 seconds. Yeah, just mute the fucking thing. You know thing. what's bad though, man? I and really I swore can't. a lot there. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I have to say, I'm not going to lie. Like, if I open like a link. And it takes more than like three seconds to open. I close it. I don't even go to it. Really? <laughs> yeah. I give up on it. Like straight wow. up. Wow. Dude, my Reddit experience is like harshly limited due to that fact. Fuck, man. I'm like, hey, I'm going to open this. I give the I'm website open, at I'm least op- 10 seconds. No, nope. <laughs> I'm going to open this picture. One, two. Nope. Close. Dude, you're the, you're part of the problem. <laughs> no. But I, things like YouTube, I deal with it because I want to watch the content. Yeah. I don't really need to see the picture that bad. But yeah, man. I I, I, I give it a chance because I have the benefit of the doubt. We're like maybe the internet's fucked up. I don't know. No, maybe I got this no. fucked up. I'm maybe sitting right know. here, man. It's not. <laughs> it's right there. It's hey, working. I'm right beside my router sometimes, yeah. and it's like I can't do it right Ugh. now. But I also have like 80 devices connected to it. Yeah, so that's it's, true. That's true. That's true. I got my. Yeah, I'm not gonna list out my 80. Devices. You know what? Uh, <laughs> I, hope, <laughs> I hope he never listens to this. But my old uh, roommate, <laughs> not Ben, the other guy. Uh, <laughs> I like. I'm not gonna lie, there's a couple times where like my shit was really slow and I throttled the shit out of his PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> I only did it maybe I only did it maybe like three times. I don't think he listens, but if he does, He's he'll probably hate me. like fucking guy. I yeah, I totally man. I was I was doing shit and it I'm just always wasn't over. I was like, not throttle. I'm always over. I pay for unlimited. Yeah, I should do that too because I have 400 15, gigs. Oh, 400 gigs is nothing. Nothing because I because I I stream stuff and download everything legally. And legally. Um, <laughs> legally, you got to look at the camera when you do it, though. Yeah, <laughs> I pledge allegiance. Oh, that's America. We don't. Yeah, work. we don't. Yeah, we're not part of that. Um, but yeah, I'm always over by like 100 gigs usually. Now I'm gonna pay like 20 bucks extra. Yeah, see, 15, and then it's unlimited. Who yeah. do you have? Tell us. Yeah, I got the same thing as you. Oh, like yeah. I got these two yeah, yeah, exact yeah. same things. Dude, uh, the month that um, my uh, first roommate moved out. He wasn't getting internet for like three weeks at his new place, so he torrented like all the TV shows. You know, you know how much are we used for data? Two thousand gigabytes. <laughs> Five times what I was allowed, but I was paying unlimited, so I didn't have oh, to. Oh wow! But I got. See, I, I wonder how I much was, you have to pay for that, though. I don't know, man. I was waiting for the letter. Yeah. Oh, like, I've gotten like seven letters. Really? I haven't yeah. got anything. I but got see, one I at the university. They can't do anything. I got an email from the university. I was torrenting there because I was like, yeah, it's fast up here. I didn't think about I, it. I do that all the time up there. Dude, all they, the fucking time. I got time. an email from the network security people, and they're like, yeah, you need to not do this or we'll revoke your. I'm like, shit. Dude, I, I was downloading shows. I was shows on top of yeah. shows on top of Dude, shows. Dude, I was there one day doing homework, and I, to- I had like, you know, like, a well, I, gig- I had like at, 10. At, at, Hundred gigabytes of shit downloading, man. At, I'm like, fuck yeah. It's at fast one point, here. it was going up five gigs per second. I know it's so know, fast. Like, <laughs> I was like, this is amazing. And then like a week later, I was doing it again, and I got an email like on a Saturday, in the morning. I logged in and was like, yeah, you need to like you need stop to calm doing the fuck this, down. or we're gonna revoke your username to log into the internet. I was like, she. <laughs> you could just stop. use somebody else's. Yeah, I know. But you could use mine. Mine probably still exists. I was panicking. I'm like, I need this. This is the only reason I survived school. <laughs> Mine's probably up, still up there. I should go check that out. Yeah, I, I probably should. If you're an alumni, I don't think it goes away. No, it doesn't go away. Yeah. So funny. in the in the end, we don't like ads. No, we, like we don't ads. like ads. We like ads. We kind of like ads sometimes, <laughs> but we kind of don't. So what do we get at the end of this conversation? If I had to say either <laughs> don't do ads or do ads, I would say don't do ads. In my opinion is do ads, but keep them under control. Yeah, but that's really hard to say. Like, if you and me were doing an ad and someone was giving us a thousand, and then some other company came in, Stamps.com, hey, we'll give you... You fucking hate this company, man. I really don't like (laughs) Stamps.com. We'll give you five grand. I'm not going to lie. I'm probably going to be advertising Stamps.com. Oh, yeah. 100%. (laughs) And then we are the biggest hypocrites ever. (laughs) Oh, yeah. Hypocrite one and hypocrite two. Stamps.com. Whatever. Whatever fills the war chest. Yeah, exactly. (laughs)